got to tell you, I love having my next guest on. Hey there, what's going on, e-bike enthusiast? It's your boy Icy Blue over here, man, with your boy Electric Dave. Electric Dave came by, brought his uh, chariot. He got that swag tron. Looking good, Dave. Looking good. The EB7. Got to charge it. He's charging her up. He's charging her up. He has entertained millions of people for decades. Got disc brakes in the front. Mechanical disc brakes in the front. Mechanical disc brakes in the back. Got light for the front when he rides at night. In the back, we just got a reflector. I don't know whether this is going to work or not, but anyway, <laughs> give it a shot. All right. We do have suspension in the back. Hard fork in the front. Completely foldable. The bike folds in half. The handlebars fold down. And as you can see, the pedals fold. Oh, natural born salesman. Excuse me. Hey, do I come to the hag shop bother you when you're working? Tell us a little more what you got up here, Dave. I got I got the I got the um, speed. You got a little throttle, right? Got the throttle. Yeah, got your throttle. You can ride it like a motorcycle. Or you can pedal it and use pedal assist. Come on, man. You know, a lot of people are concerned about my mental ability. This is Swag Squad EB7, Electric Days, Little Chariot. This is my analog bike. I got the Genesis V2100. Put a lot of miles in on that big boy. He done popped out on the electric side on me. Made me step my game up. Let me tell you something, man. This one, one, one. <laughs> right here, my here. short time memory is perfect. <laughs> my short time memory is absolutely perfect. the way they run over. And another thing, man. My short time memory is good too. Okay, this is it, Dave. Uh, I, I got my my check it out, right? Back down. Seat post, get one of the seat post racks. Seat post rack, that reflector. That seat, got a nice seat. I like like that, that seat, how about that seat? You like that seat? That's that good leather. That's it's kind of firm. Feels like, feels like, uh, it's probably foam inside. Not very plush, but it's, it's, it's a solid seat. Tell about the chain. The chain, chain ain't nothing to fuck with. Chain. Of course, the swag trons, they've got the, uh, pedal assist. It's a single drive. Hey, bike. He's got a double chain guard on there, so that's pretty nice. You can break them down, break them down like this. You can put it back in the truck, or whatever. You can break them down. Right here, you break them down. You can break, break them down right here. It's not that hard to break them down. Well, I ain't gonna break them down right now. I might have to go out a little bit. So I'm glad you give it 
dirty over here. You just put a little, little work in on this bad boy already, okay? Okay. <sighs> Congratulations, Electric Dave. That's a nice, nice purchase. Yo, if you're an enthusiast, you just like getting out. Hey, should they get an electric bike? Does it help for your, your rides? Best move, electric bike, say gas, get in shape, get, you ain't gotta use the electric every five seconds, you can pedal, you can pedal, say, say the electric, it charges up, but you you don't wanna go a million miles thinking, thinking you in the, in, the, in the SUV or something, you know, and uh, that, that's two sets of keys, that's some chase, Okay, so a couple questions for you there, Electric Dave. Between the two, you've rode both bikes now. As far as comfortable ride, which one do you prefer? Well, the Genesis is good, but you, you want the electric bike. You want, you want to save you some power, you want, you want to, and then you can ride, you, 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 you can push the metal to the pedal right here, save you some electric. We live in a little more hilly area though, right? not really a lot of flat land around here. It's, it's a lot of hills and stuff, right? So, yeah, so sometimes you wanna you wanna put the metal instead of trying to keep clocking up, up and down like it's a football game. So the electric bike helps you out with the hills, correct? Yes, sir, yes, sir. And this right here, I believe, is a 350 watt rear hub motor. It's not the biggest, strongest motor. This isn't the biggest, strongest, fastest bike, but it does a good job for you, right? Yeah, yeah, and it'll get you the A and B. Then, you, you, I mean, uh, unless you want to carry your charger with you, and then you can maybe say you're going to your buddy house or whatnot, but I don't know about carrying the charger because... It's kind of small, fit in your hand, you put in your pocket, you can carry that anywhere. So yeah, if you're riding to your buddy's house, you can charge up there while you're sitting there, right? Drinking a beer right. or whatever. Yep. You don't want to be on those little crossroads where ain't no, nobody you know to charge it in. You know, fuck the client, but you don't want to deal with that. No, no, no. In the area, the they area. like to hit the local trails or cruise around town. It's a lot of, a lot of those spots in Zancu you can hit. A lot of spots, a lot of spots. So the home Electric Dave is throwing out the invite if you want to uh, gang ride and, and enjoy the summer coming out of the covid restrictions getting ready to spread some wings you look like a and hey more than welcome take a little path ride city ride we'll get at you on that of course your boy blue over here he got the analog i try to keep up but we got us an electric bike coming as well. So it's going to be a team electric over here. Shout out to everybody that's interested. Yo, if you like it, get down with the squad. Yo, that's going to be it from us over here at the electric team. Your boy Electric Dave. You got Icy Blue in the back. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more from your boys over here on Electric Trend. I see blue. Two and two.